Imagine borrowing an extra day every four years, without it, our seasons would drift out of sync. But why exactly do we need leap years? Let's uncover the secret. It takes Earth about 365.24219 days to complete one orbit, this is the tropical year, which governs our seasons. Yet our standard calendar only has 365 days, leaving a gap of 0.24219 days, roughly 5 hours, 48 minutes, 45 seconds. Over 4 years, that tiny fraction adds up to nearly one full day. In 45 BCE, Julius Caesar introduced the Julian calendar to fix this drift, every year divisible by 4 becomes a leap year. February gains an extra day, making it 29 days long. This gave an average year length of 365.25 days, much closer to the true tropical year. However, 365.25 days was still slightly too long, by about 11 minutes per year. So in 1582, Pope Gregory XIII refined the system with three simple rules, 1, if a year is divisible by four leap year. 2, unless it's divisible by 100 common year. 3, unless it's also divisible by 400 leap year again. This tweak yields an average year of 365.2425 days, almost perfectly matching the tropical year. Without leap year adjustments, seasons would shift by one day every four years, one month every 120 years, or three months in 360 years. Imagine Christmas in summer, total chaos. Leap years keep our seasons, holidays, and daily lives aligned with Earth's journey around the sun. Now you know why February sometimes has 29 days, it's our way of staying in sync with Earth's orbit. What do you think about our extra day? Share your thoughts in the comments, hit like if you learned something new, subscribe for more fascinating timekeeping secrets, and share this video with your friends. See you next time.